a lot of things, you know, Nathan had a lot of things going on, but he wasn't from a broken home and he wasn't, you know, didn't live on the wrong side of the tracks and he, he had a lot going for him, but he didn't, you know, it was this, I thought he needed more. I think it's helped him immensely. He is uh, more open with me now that he's, since he's been going there, he's better to his sister. I've just never known him to be that self-aware and him to be so grounded with what he was with, and I don't remember the exact words and I wish I did, but I was just left with this feeling that like, he knows who he is and he knows what he's gonna do and. Um, I think it was probably one of the best things that we ever did for Nathan, or my wife ever did, was finding the uh, Boys to Men and getting him signed up and him going. Uh, we're very happy with the progress that Boys of Men have made with Nathan. Um, my son just absolutely loves the program, and uh, I think he is a better man for being belonging to the program. You people have done things for him that, you know, my wife and I couldn't figure out how to do. So. I've been involved with Boys to Men New England for almost five years, and I found Boys to Men for my son Alex, who was 12 at the time and is now 17. I've been a single mom since he was two and three quarters. And I was very interested in finding a group of men who could provide good male role models for my son and also for him to have the benefit of mentorship and community with men, since as a woman I couldn't provide that on my own. Boys to Men New England and Boys to Men as a whole program is a unique mentoring program. It's different than Big Brothers because rather than just providing a one-on-one -on -one relationship with one boy and one man, we do mentoring in community, mentoring in a group setting, so that it's a number of teenage boys ages 12 to 17 and a number of mentors. Whereas in Boys to Men, one of the beautiful things is that the mentors take down their masks and they look at what was it like to be a teen. It's often very hard to go through the teenage years. It's a painful time. It's a time where people often feel alone. And to have a place where men will actually talk about that and where teens have the freedom and the safety and the permission to talk about what it's like too is very powerful. And when one person can speak that way, it makes it safer for other people to share how they feel and share their experiences as well. Another special feature of Boys to Men is we provide trainings both for the teens and for the mentors. For the mentors, there's a weekend program that gives them a chance to revisit their teenage years and do some healing work on their experiences, which prepares them to have a lot more compassion and empathy for the boys in the program. In the program for teens, it's a rite of passage. One of the things that we don't provide for people who are teens, either boys or girls in our culture, are rites of passage. And it's a very important time in one's life. And the the ability to mark that and to have a way to honor the transition from being a boy to a man and explore what it means to be a man is a very powerful experience.